All right, this is Pastor Pat and day 23 of our 30 days of being united in prayer for our nation and for our churches. It is June the 27th and our emphasis of prayer is to be praying for college students. Whether they have never heard the gospel or have fallen away, may young people learn more about Jesus to truly be discipled and gain a strong understanding of scripture. Of course, I think of our Kaiafa ministries and the work that they do and how God is using them to, to really change people's hearts and lives. And I think of Samuel Gingrich and his heart and his passion is to create disciples who create disciples. And we need to be praying to that end, to that effect for his ministry, that he raises up young people who, who fall in love with Jesus and have a desire to see others fall in love with Jesus. Now, college though, I think of when many people go off to college, they may be coming from a strong Christian background. They may have a good understanding of scripture. They may have uh, a good church life. And then they go off to school and all of these other theologies and, and doctrines and beliefs and everything else that could be going on in the world is challenging their Christian background. We need to be praying for their protection against those things. And many people go thinking that they're gaining knowledge. Well, I think of Proverbs fourteen twelve. It says, there is a way that seems right to a man, but its end is the way of death. The knowledge of this world will fade away. The truth of Jesus Christ will never fade away. It, it is constant. So we need to be praying to that effect, that young people come to know Jesus, even in this, this confusing age in which we're living, where everything challenges God, everything challenges the word of God. So let's pray. And let's pray for our Kaiafa leaders. Let's pray for Samuel Gingrich. Let's pray for those that are ministering to our uh, college age students in our communities. Father, we thank you for this, this challenge to pray for unity and, and for just the gospel to be preached and reach hearts. And so, Father, we do lift up the, the young people like in college today, the, the young people that are going off to school, trying to gain an education and new knowledge and new understanding. But Lord, we pray in the name of Jesus that you guard them on all sides, that the word of God find a deep, deep place in their life that their hearts would be settled on the word of God, their mind would be fixated on the word of God, that when things come to challenge it, the word of God is no longer in question, but it is right, it is the truth, it is the one thing that they hold to as they grow in their relationship with Jesus Christ. But Lord, there's so many that need to know you, so many that need to come to know you. And we pray for Samuel Gingrich, and we pray for Kaiafa Ministries, that Father, the ministry that is done on campuses would be greatly effective. And that Holy Spirit you lead and you change hearts and you win hearts, even in the darkest of places now. Father, we thank you and we ask that Lord, you be glorified in our local college campuses. In Jesus name. Well, thank you all. Uh, keep praying. Prayer, nothing happens without prayer. So we, we need to continue in this attitude, in this heart of prayer. Thank you all. Hope to see you soon.